trade for pound today. Thanks for your time. Should get, you should get Rich to tell you about the time he almost right. shot 59 after the Birkdale withdrawal. Career, um, career low for you. Our congratulations or condolences in order? Either one. I don't really care. It's a good score. I'm, I'm happy with it. I, you know, I'm, I played really well yesterday. I just I didn't make any putts. Um, today I played, you know, played the same. I just, you know, rolled in, rolled in some putts, and um, you know, so it was definitely nice to see the see the ball going in the hole. I'm sure you've been asked all this stuff before, but but when you're six under through four, when you're nine under through eight, it, what, what goes through your mind? No, I just keep trying to make birdies. Um, you know, I'm swinging good. Uh, as long as I could get it in the fairway, I knew I could attack the golf course. You know, the greens are still receptive. I mean, they started to bounce a little more to th this afternoon, but, you know, still receptive enough to, to be aggressive with, with your shots if you're coming out of the fairway. Were you thinking 59 or lower at any point in the round? And if not, why not? Yeah, I was, I was trying to birdie every hole. So, um, you know, just on the back nine, I just didn't get in the fairway fairway enough to attack all the flags. Um, when I was in the fairway, I hit nice shots, though, and uh, gave myself some good looks. 13 and 17, yeah. things like that. 15, and I think. 15 was in that rough, though, right? I don't know. Four. Don't worry about it. Whatever. I don't know. Um, I get confused on the holes. What, why, um, what, why not hit three wood? At, at what point did were you always think really, I just didn't really think about it, honestly. Um, yeah, I mean, because I, I kind of like hitting that little little chippy low cut, and I just pushed it a hair. You're trying to, I mean, you, you said you're trying to basically birdie every hole. You get down to 18, you surely know it's a it's a birdie for, for a 59. Yeah. At, at that point. Absolutely. Is it, are, are you approaching that effort at birdie any differently than, than just going through the back nine? You know what I mean by that? No, I mean, I'm, I mean, no matter what score I'm at, Going into 18 on you know here on this part it's downwind today, um, you know I'm always trying to make a birdie. Going back to my original question, I I know how you feel about it. It's a pretty good. It's your best ever. Uh, but do you, do you get a sense that everyone's kind of feels feels bad for you? <laughs> I don't know. I wanted to shoot 59. I've never done it, so that'd have ever? been nice. I don't think so. Wow. Not that I remember, and I think I'd remember that. <laughs> On your on your putting, DJ, there was a couple times it looked like there was a movement you were making. Yeah, it's just way. it's just a drill I do on the putting green. So I was, I don't know, I did it today. It worked out there just to get, it just gets my right arm set where I want it to be, and just so I can get the feel. Do it before I take my practice strokes, and just so I get it set set well, and um, then go from there. Is that a product of, of yesterday? Any frustration from yeah, just not a little bit. not rolling it in? But yeah, I mean, I worked on it yesterday afternoon and then some more this morning. So I feel good over the putter. I feel like, you know, I'm rolling it nicely, hitting it, hitting it down the lines. What do you think you'll shoot tomorrow? I have no idea. I'm going to go out and shoot as low as I can, though. <laughs> is it, it nerve-wracking to be that? I'm not sure if nerve-wracking is the right word, but is it, is it no. nerve-wracking to be that deep under par? It's, no, it's not nerve-wracking. I mean, obviously, you know, trying to shoot 59, you, you know, you can – you can definitely feel it, you know. And two, obviously, I knew I was in the, you know, was leading also. So, you know, coming down the stretch, you maybe put a little more pressure on yourself because you want to you want to make those birdies or make those putts. But, you know, I made some nice par putts to keep myself in the in the game. So, um, but yeah, it is what it is. I'm in a good spot, and I'll come out tomorrow and try to shoot another low one. We should, we should said it was some of the easiest golf we've ever seen. Front nine. Did it feel that way to you? Yeah, I mean, I was, you know, hitting the fairway, and you know, I was swing. I'm swinging my irons really well, so I, you know, I hit a lot of shots really close to the hole. Um, you know, made a couple, made a long putt on two. That was that was a long one. You know, maybe 30 foot or whatever, 40 feet. Um, you know, that was obviously a bonus, but the rest of them were, you know, inside of 10 feet, maybe one 15 footer, maybe. Um, you know, so I was hitting it. Hitting it where I wanted to and leaving myself a good good putt. Did you miss the fairway of four, though? Yeah, it's because I was on the green. <laughs> you there? Driver. driver. I had a little, the little chip driver up there to about four feet. It's nice. Justin, when did you see that Scotty had shot 59? Mm, early in my round. What would you think? It's a good score. <laughs> he played well today. <laughs> I was trying to catch him though. <laughs>
Thanks. Thank you. I think that's